Now I'll show you how to make the world's best brunsvier by using an original Danish recipe. First I make a pre dough. Add a little bit of yeast, the size of a pea. Add enough water to make the dough mushy and add flour. Mix it together and let it rest until the next day. Now we'll make the vanilla cream. Mix whole milk and sugar together in a pot. Slice a quarter of vanilla stick and add it. Put the pot over medium heat and stir regularly so that its sugar does not burn. Secondly, whisk the egg yolks and cornstarch together until there are no more lumps. When the milk boils, take it off the heat and whip it together. Put it back on medium heat and whip constantly while boiling for 2 minutes. Then, pour it into a container and let it cool down for about minimum 3 hours. Day 2. Now we're gonna make the dough itself. And first we take the pre-dough from yesterday. We add flour, add half whole milk, half water. Add yeast, a little bit of salt, one egg, sugar and now sour cream to give it that extra moisture to the batter. Add a pinch of cardamom for a tiny bit of that warm spicy sweet flavor. Mix it all together and when the dough comes together, add melted margarine. Knead until the dough is shiny and gets out of the bowl easily. Then press it into a baking dish, make some holes in the batter with your fingertips all over the place and then let it rest for 10 minutes. Next up, mix soft butter and brown sugar together. Melt it on medium heat and then add syrup. When it's well mixed, add the vanilla cream from yesterday. Remember to remove the vanilla stick from the cream itself. Now back to the batter. With your fingertips, once again press the dough to make holes everywhere in it. Spread the remonts evenly all over the dough. And let this brown warrior raise for about 45 minutes until it's almost twice as high. Once it's raised for 45 minutes, get those fingers down there again and make holes once again. This time I preheated the oven to 200 degrees Celsius and baked it for 12 minutes in the middle of the oven. Next time I'll try with 180 degrees as this should result in an even more soft and moisture base. Serve just as it is or with a bit of vanilla ice cream on top. Now please enjoy the world's best brunswick. If you like this video, please hit that like button and share the video with your friends and family and subscribe for more great content in the future. Thanks a lot for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!